Cyber threats are escalating and AI is making them faster, smarter, and more dangerous. Here's what's going on as we wrap up August 2025. Anthropic is reporting that there's folks out there that are harnessing Claude AI to automate large parts of a data extortion campaign, potentially impacting at least 17 organizations. And overall, AI is now executing cyber attacks, not just advising on them. AI-generated malware has lowered the barrier for entry, enabling criminals with minimal skills to pull off sophisticated operations. And AI is now embedded in every stage of fraud operations, from profiling victims and analyzing stolen data to creating fake identities and scaling these scams. The real world fallout, now not necessarily connected to these 17 organizations, but reported this past week, Farmers Insurance said that a third party vendor breach exposed data on over 1 million policy holders, including names, addresses, birth dates, and driver's license numbers. I'm a farmer's customer, uh-oh. Also PayPal. So there's a data set of 16 million user logins out there, so emails and plain text passwords. And they surfaced on the dark web for just two bucks. Now, experts suspect this info stealer ma this is info stealer malware, not a fresh hack, but credential stuffing is a huge risk in and of itself. Also notab notable, PayPal is denying it. This is like old data. And TransUnion this week, one of the big three credit bureaus confirmed a Salesforce link breach. So third party, once again, impacting little over 4 million US consumers. And it's tied to the Shiny Hunters extortion group. Some of that data included uh, social security numbers. So from AI powered crime to massive data leaks, the threat landscape is certainly getting worse. You must deploy advanced detection and countermeasures like clicks or one and stay ahead by any means possible. Just keep yourself informed of all this nasty stuff going around. And by the way, Anthropic has a full report on their research. Quite fascinating. I'm Peter for Plexer. Like and sub.